In uh, this video, I'm going to talk about chromosome number as well as something called homologous pairs. Okay, um, you should know that we as humans have 46 chromosomes, and now I'm looking at that and I realize chromosomes is spelled wrong, sorry. Um, fruit flies, a uh, species uh, named Drosophila melanogaster, have eight chromosomes. So, um, if anything is in common there, in both cases, our chromosomes always come in pairs, so you will um, have an even number of total chromosomes, okay? And so you might be able to think of a set of our chromosomes that you hear about coming in pairs. When I think of chromosomes as a set that I might have heard of or that people talk about, you think about the sex chromosomes, The sex chromosomes, I, I mean, you think about boys have XY and girls have XX or something like that. The chromosomes that determine uh, what sex you are come in a pair. So when I think about that, I think about uh, sex chromosomes. They always come in pairs. Um, and so this is a picture of chromosomes. And we're going to talk about this um, at a later time, but this is called a karyotype which is basically a picture of our chromosomes. And what do you notice? We have pairs, they're numbered one through 22, and then we have our sex chromosome pair. So that's 23 pairs, which is a total of 46 chromosomes total. And they always come in pairs, and the pairs are very similar in size and shape. And in fact, they will have the same genes on them or similar genes. And again, this idea that our uh, chromosomes come in pairs, this makes sense because we should have basically two sets of chromosomes, one from our dad and one from our mom, because we understand that that's how we got our genetic code. Therefore, things come in pairs. One of the pair came from my dad. Let's just call this the blue pair. And one of the pair came from my mother. Um, and so I got one chromosome number one from my mom one chromosome number one from my dad, and therefore I have a pair of chromosomes numbered one. And so we call these pairs homologous pairs, and we should be able to recognize that homo prefix meaning the same. Um, homologous pairs are a set of chromosomes where one pair comes from the male parent and the other pair comes from the female parent. And so just thinking about this, we could just say, oh, well, this one came from my mom, this one came from my dad over here, maybe this one came from my dad and this one came from my mom. We can't tell, except with boys, we can tell with the sex chromosomes, but that's a genetics thing that we'll talk about later. So here are a couple problems you might see associated with homologous pairs. You should know that if we have 46 total chromosomes, um, then we have 23 homologous pairs uh, in humans. We said Drosophila flies have eight total chromosomes, therefore they have four homologous pairs. Um, and because, again, things come in pairs, I'm just dividing the total by two. How many does an organism with 40 chromosomes have? They would have 20 pairs.